Hey there everybody, it's Q-Tip here, and we're back with more Legend of Zelda. And no, I do not want to use my letter. In the last episode, we adventured around and we found this lady's chickens. In this episode, we're going to figure out where the hell to go. And, well, as you may remember, I needed to take out my Orcarina in order to get to that grave. But, I didn't have a stick. Well, this is both fortunate and unfortunate for us, since, well, as fate would have it, we need to complete the Deku Tree anyway. I was thinking about it the other day, and I realized we need to complete... Excuse me, I am trying to leave town. But yeah, we need the slingshot to finish the, uh... Kid Fire Dungeon, the Donkey's Cavern. So, now we gotta go back and do the deck injury anyway. But oh well. Might as well, right? And I don't think we're gonna get it there by morning. But oh well, we can see what happens if we go into that cutscene at night. So, that's something. We ain't getting something nothing. We ain't getting something for nothing. We're not gonna have to do something for nothing. And I was way off base. Come on. Right, go. Away. You skelly mans. There we go. Now they shouldn't be able to catch us. Ugh. Even with this backtracking, it still takes forever. Now, if I mess up with the buttons especially, like, a lot, then that's because I've been playing a lot of Dark Souls and I've been using the same controller. So, that's gonna lead to some trouble here. Oh, look who's back! I thought we killed you! Whatever. Okay. Seems that everybody's still awake despite it being night time. Both that's all right. Their lives, they can do what they want. I'm a pretty nocturnal creature, and I when I'm given the chance. Uh, what? I guess if you come here at night time, Mido's is not here. Sweet. Oh, that works for me. All right, let's get ourselves the Deku stick here. Now that's basically the most important item in the game. At least for me. Because you can do some stuff, pretty dangerous stuff, with just that. Great Deku Tree, I'm back. Oh, it only took you like three days. What the hell were you, Navi? You just needed to pick up a kid and get him over here. Oh, Navi, that's how I returned. I'm gay. Welcome. Listen carefully to what I, the Deku Tree, am about to tell you. Thy slumber these past moons must have been restless and full of nightmares. As the servants of evil gain strength, a vile climate pervades the land and causes nightmares to those sensitive to it. Verily, thou hast felt it. I'm gay. The time has come to test thy courage. I don't like where this is going! I have been cursed. Well, it's not a curse. Listen, it's comments like that are, that are setting human relations back. I need you to break the curse with your wisdom and courage. Dost thou have the courage enough to undertake this task? Yes! Then enter, brave I'm gay. And thou too, Navi. Navi the fairy, thou must aid I'm gay. And I'm gay. And Navi speaks, use up to listen well to her words of wisdom. Well, that was probably the first, uh time that our name didn't make it incredibly funny. It didn't fit perfectly. He made, it he made very sure to reference me and not just say my name. Alright, as you may be able to tell, that wasn't here before. And there used to be a guy over here, but he's not. Welcome to Master Quest. The overworld may be basically the same. But, there are quite a few changes in regard to the way that dungeons are laid out. Normally you can just climb up those vines back there, but in Master Quest this is 
spider guy. So you can't really do that. Now, that's not a huge setback, but these bats are another story. Luckily, they're pretty easily dealt with. Oh. This is now the, I'm in the middle of trying to stab people. Now these eggs here, they're the ones that fall from the ceiling and turn into those guys that take two hits to kill. So I don't want to deal with that, so I'm just gonna jump attack them while they're in their egg and commit spider abortion. Alright, now we got a map. Even though, really, do we need it? Man, this guy. I've actually died to that guy before. It's kind of embarrassing. What I mean, kind of. That's incredibly embarrassing. Okay. I'm pretty sure you're able to climb up this safely because I can't think of anywhere else to go. Alright. As it turns out, I'm correct. Beautiful. Oh, oh, I was dealing with the camera. Oh. Come on now. I probably should have waited and killed him for getting the deco nuts. What you gonna do? Miss me. No, no. There we go. Give me my nuts. Alright, I'm gonna just, uh, kill this guy before I step on that switch, because I have a feeling about what it does. Yep. That would have been bad news for everybody. Oh. Well, there goes that stick. Stick be gone. You can open a door by standing in front of it and pressing A. You know, we haven't opened doors already. Have we? Uh-oh. Uh-oh! Oh god! Oh god, it's so bad! I just gotta take this one step at a time, Q-tip. One step at a time. Ow. Ow. Or you can just go and lose all your health, that might work too. I chow to Alright, luckily there's a never-ending sp spawn of health points there, so really. That removes the challenge of this room. to go. Alright. Do you even need to take that middle one? Nope. Nice! Uh, I think this is the only one left. <sighs> I keep jumping in them. Calm down, Link. Jump happy. Yay! Compass! That's my guess, because damn things never have anything useful in them. Alright, let's go equip our stick here so we can actually make use of them, since we've been working so hard to get them. There we go. Hey, and a small chest. Probably nothing useful in that, probably like a heart. Might as well go get it first. Oh my god, five rubies! I don't need to fight evil no more, we can retire. Man, this isn't monotonous at all. Pressing buttons and leaping on the same platforms. Let's 
So far, you can probably tell the level of challenge isn't that much higher. Hey, the slingshot. Now we don't have to finish this dungeon. But we might as well, we're already here. If you want to shoot right away, then first you C. Hold down C and get a seed ready. Press C to C seed. Got it. Oof! That's weird. Why did he not turn into a fire bat? Uh, oh. What? frustrating. No, it didn't really set us back that far. Okay. I don't want to look at your ugly face. That's it. Some people just don't get the hint. Yeah, beautiful seeds, whatever. Alright. Now let's hit this eyeball. Right in the eyeball! I actually try to turn the controller to aim it. I've been playing too much Wii U. the guys in the room. Wait, what was the point of all of that? There's nothing left in here. How do I open that door? Do I have to... Oh, god damn it. Actually, no, not god damn it, because we needed to come. We needed to do that anyway. That's exactly what we needed to do. Stop trying to hump the plant, Link. We got work to do. Ah! Oh yeah, Claire finally came over, and we actually managed to record some stuff. We recorded, uh, well, we were supposed to record a uh, Pokemon Puzzle League, but what ended up happening was uh, the audio quality was just so bad in that video. We had to get rid of it. It was so bad. Like every second, like I don't, I don't know what you would call it, like the equivalent of a frame, but for audio, was missing. Mixed the voices of those characters. It was not pleasant. All right, where are we out here? Okay, we got an egg. We'll deal with that now. I'm just telling you I won't be able to make nope. Right. Thought I got rid of you. There we go. Man, I hate you, fraps. Listen, the N64 can handle this. You can handle this. So you have no choice but to make it. Huh. It turns out I can make it. Right, come on, save my stick. 
Alright, we did it. Alright, what about you, big guy? Yeah, no big trouble from that guy. Oh great, more of these guys. They're not getting old yet. Oh no. Fuck off, up C. Alright, so there goes my last good controller. I'm just destined not to have good controllers. Maybe I should stop dropping them. So what do we got here? We got a bat. It's off, bat. We should talk about the dungeon while we're in here. So, uh, this is inside the Great Deku Tree, as you probably already, am as you can probably imagine. No, I don't want my damn thing. And this is one of the hardest dungeons to speed run in the game. It requires very specific movements, and basically, you have to get everything right, or else your run fails. You get like one chance to start things. But, it's also the only dungeon you have to do, so... I guess it's also the easiest one that you have to, when you speedrun. Because this is the, uh... This is the one where they skipped to Ganondorf's tower using the ROM warp. Actually, I should probably explain what ROM warping is. Did I already explain what ROM warping is? I'm gonna assume it is. If I didn't, then... Well, you gotta look that up. It's pretty interesting stuff. Cosmo does a speed run of this game. He managed to get under 20 minutes. I'm pretty sure I already said that. Oh shit, that's a big guy. Uh, we are outside of his sphere of influence, so I don't think we have to worry too much. And he's no match for his deck. Oh, I was hoping for a giant stick. Oh well. Well, that room completely wasted time. Uh, time for your shit, bats. Damn it. Over with. Oh, another one of the. Stop shooting your nuts in my face. <laughs> 